Mike's carburetor parts here doing a video on a Carter YF one barrel carburetor and we're going to talk about the idle circuit. If you're having trouble with uh, your vehicle idling smoothly uh, then uh, you will need to know about this circuit so you know what to fix, what to clean. So right here is the idle mixer screw. Now this is the older YF by the way it's got the cast iron bottom. Uh, the newer the YFAs will have aluminum bottom and uh, all right I forgot where the hole went all right so this is where the idle mixture screw goes and you want to take it out and look through the hole make sure it goes all the way through and it, if you can see it right here there's a little hole right here where it goes through kind of hard to see probably and get the light just right little hole right here okay so that's where it goes through from the idle mixture uh, right here is a slot and what that slot is used for is when you get uh, you start getting off of idle and you hear this you can see the slot better right here um, you need to a a a get a little bit more fuel so that's what that slots for as you open the uh, throttle it uh, exposes that slot more and more, lets more uh, air fuel mixture in. Uh, this is your passageway. So if anything's plugged, uh, you can take this plug out to clean it out. Just blow air through here, make sure it's coming out of the slot. Uh, let's see. And then uh, this goes on here like a like a so when you go to put it together and right here is the uh, idle tube and with the idle tube air from the bore and fuel from the main uh, from the float bowl uh, the air fuel mi mixture is mixed right here and then travels down through the bowl through the throttle body via this hole here and uh, into the carburetor so that's how it works uh, when you put these together uh, oh by the way check your uh, mixture screw for any grooves what I usually do is buff them out and if there's any grooves uh, replace your idle mixture screw and what happens people tighten them too tight and it creates a groove in there and it won't idle right so if that's the case change your screw uh, most of our screws are sold by size they're almost all 8 by 32's but the lengths are different and the ends taper a little different so you'll have to look around so you put this in and then turn it out Oh, about a turn and a half to start with and then once you get on the vehicle you let the engine warm up and get your idle right here set your idles at, at uh, manufacturer specs and then adjust your idle mixture okay once you get off of idle uh, as you can see once you get uh, like th right there uh, you're past the idle circuit and uh, on into the cruising speed and whatnot. So, um, if your idle mixture is not making any difference when you turn that screw, it may be that you're idling too fast to start with. So, I'd just like to point that out. All right, so that's your uh, idle circuit. Thank you for watching.